Hey, it's Vicki Howell here to show you how to do the knit stitch using the English method. This is sometimes also called throwing. For this method, you're going to insert the right hand needle into the stitch on the left hand needle. You're going to take your working yarn, which is the yarn connected to the skein, and I like to just for tension's purpose wrap my yarn around my index finger like that and usually hold the rest of it with the other fingers. You're going to wrap the yarn away from you, around, come down, and you'll see the loop formed. This is your next step, uh, stitch, and pull it off. And that's your first stitch. So you go to the next one. You're going to come up through the stitch, wrap around. Now this is the part that's usually the fussiest, so you take this slow, bring your tip down, and then pull the stitch off. I usually hold the other stitches that I'm not working with kind of securely with my finger just so I don't accidentally pull them all off because there's nothing more frustrating than losing a bunch of stitches that way. Up, around, and off. Up, around, off. Okay, so I'm going to finish these. And then when I come to the end, to start the next row, can, assuming that we're just using the knit stitch for whatever it is that we're making, You're going to flip it over and you want to make sure that your working yarn is down because if it's up you can see that the bottom of the stitch looks like two loops and what will happen is you'll knit those and you'll end up having a piece that's at an angle. So you keep that yarn down here and then you just start again. It's the same thing. You just flip it over and continue knitting. And now my friends you are on your way to knitting your first garment. Hi there, it's Vicki Howell and I'm here to show you how to do the purl stitch using the English method. We've got our stitches cast on, so we're ready to begin. Some people really don't enjoy the purl stitch at first, but if you can just remember it's the exact opposite of the knit stitch, it ends up not being any big deal at all. So, we're on our first stitch, we're going to come down through the loop and hold it in a little X pattern with our thumb and wrap the yarn around the front needle this time as opposed to the back needle if we're doing the knit stitch and we go under and you can see right here this is the stitch we're creating so we have to pull it off. should also mention very essential your working yarn for this one needs to be in the front at all times Coming down, insert through the loop on your left hand needle. Hold on to the needles with your thumb and finger. Wrap around, dip under to create your stitch and pull off the old one. Down, around, dip, off. Down, around, dip, off, down, around, dip, off. And that's all there is to it. See, purling is super easy and really fun.